Hi again everyone. So now I'm back with a thrift store haul from Value Village. I just got back from Value Village a couple minutes ago and I thought I would go ahead and video what I got. Um, I'm trying to do this in the living room. I've decided it's at night. It's nighttime here and there's just no good lighting in this house at night. But now I'm trying the living room. We'll see if this is any better. Um, I just did a thrift haul a few minutes ago in the kitchen and I didn't really like the lighting there, so I'm going to try the lighting here. Okay, so, in no random order, I'm going to pull out from the bag the things that I got. This happens to be, I think, the favorite thing that I got. And when I first saw this hanging up, I mean, I wasn't really sure about it, um, but sometimes you just have to try things on. And it's by Kenzie, or no, Kenar, sorry, it's by Kenar. And it's kind of like a mohair um, sweater. So it's, it's soft. It's kind of soft, but it's kind of rough at the same time. I don't know how to describe that. Almost feels like wool, but it's a little softer than wool. Anyways, it's um, like a dark gray, a dark gray or, or black maybe and white. And it, the sleeves are like three quarter length. It has two buttons. And let's see if I back up. So you can see the length. Um, it is so cute. I love this sweater so much. I love it. I am gonna have to have it dry clean though because I think I saw just a little spot on it and I hope the spot comes out. Pretend I'm wearing like a solid black or white shirt underneath. Um, this is such a cute sweater. I love this sweater. It's really, really soft. So you could just, if you button both buttons, it kind of opens in in the front. Let's see if I can show you. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. So, that's what it looks like. And like I said, it's really soft and you could probably just button one button. Maybe have it like that, that's comfortable too. Um, sleeves go to like here. And they're not tight sleeves, I like that they're not tight. So, I found this adorable sweater. And um, the color tag that was half off was purple, but I, there were hardly any purple tags. I think I bought one thing that had a purple tag. Um, but I did have a 20% off coupon. So this was $8, $7.99, less 20%. So $1.60 off of this. So what, like $5.40, I think, if I'm doing my math right. Um, but anyways, that was the first thing that I picked up. Like I said, I love this. And then I also got from Old Navy... And I thought this would be perfect for the holidays, um, maybe for New Year's or just around Christmas. It's a black cotton, like it almost looks like a, isn't that funny? It almost looks like a baseball jersey with the, you know, black cotton shirt. Okay, now the lighting is really bad. Um, but it has the sparkles, it has the sequins, the black sequins all down the front, the black sequins. So, and there's no sequins on the back, just on the front. It's long sleeve, just cotton shirt. Um, but I just thought that would be really fun and festive for the holidays. So I got that and it was $7 and then the 20% off of $7. So like, I don't know, $5.40. Wow, both of those things were like seven bucks. Okay, and then I also found, this is the one green item that I found. Or no, purple, I'm sorry, purple. Purple was half off. And it was regularly $7, which who, who prices their stuff? Because this is just a basic, it, I mean, there's nothing special about it. I just like the print. Um, it's like purple and dark purple or purple and navy. See that? But it's just like a little V-neck, kind of a cotton t-shirt, not real long or anything. The sleeves are like three-quarter length. Um, I just thought the print was really fun. But what I'm trying to say is, why would anybody pay $7 for this? I mean, that seems really expensive. Now, I did get it half off. It was $3.50. But, I mean, I don't understand how some of their stuff is marked, like, so high. I just don't, I don't really get it at all. It's weird to me. So, I did get this, $3.50. And then I also got a couple of jackets. This one's really cute. It's red, and it's by Positive Attitude. This was um, $9.99, less 20%, so $8. Dollars. 
and it's red. It almost looks like a faux suede. That's what it feels like, kind of a faux suede. But the really neat thing about it is around the bottom, it has these cutouts, these holes, and then these silver, it's like silver embellishments. I don't really know what you would call that. And then it has like a zipper, and it's really cute. I'll try it on really quick. Although, like I said, I don't have the right shirt on for, for trying these things on because this shirt, this sweater, which I just got the sweater at um, Kohl's actually a couple days ago. I told you, I've been shopping way too much and I need to stop. I really do. Um, isn't this cute though? And then you just zip it up or whatever. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. And it doesn't go all the way around to the back, but just along the front here. It's very comfortable. Very, very comfortable. I like that it kind of is that faux suede. So I got that. And then I just got a couple more items. A couple more things. I did get one more jacket. Um, and it's also red. That's kind of funny. I must have been in a red mood tonight. It's like a windbreaker, which I could have really used this morning. I could have thrown this on and gone out and picked up all my Halloween decorations that blew all over. Um, and it was $7.99, so $8, and then I had the 20% off. And it's just a, just a windbreaker. It has a hood, obviously hood. It's the traditional, whatever the windbreaker material is. It has a couple pockets. Pockets in front. Pocket right here. Little zipper. But anyway, so I got that. I really like this, actually. Nice lightweight jacket, although, like I said, it's really getting cold here. So, I don't know how much use I'll get of this before spring, but we'll see. And then I also got, and actually um, my sister found this. I was trying stuff on in the dressing room and somebody had put this on the, the rack, you know, like the do not want rack. And it's a really pretty shawl. And I don't know how I'm gonna clean this. I don't know, like I think somebody, somebody might have just knit this because there's no tag on it. Or maybe somebody cut the tag out. Um, but I honestly think that somebody might have made this. It's a really pretty, it's in purple, really pretty purple and like a teal, blue, green. And it's really like soft, like I don't know what you call this, like cashmere-ish feeling. I mean, I don't know what, I don't knit, so I'm not sure. But anyways, it's this shawl and it is so, and now I'm showing my tummy. It's just so soft, it's so cute. It's not great with this sweater, obviously, but I just thought this would look so nice. Um, with, you know, more of a basic color, like a black shirt or maybe even like a plum colored t-shirt with my leggings or my jeans. Anyways, I thought this was a great find. My sister found this for me and I really, really like it. It is so soft. And I think it was also $7.99. That must have been, they must, yeah, $7.99. So maybe that's their new pricing policy. I mean, pretty much everything I picked up was like $7.99. So maybe that's what they're going with now, unless it's super name brand, I, I don't know. So I got that, and um, that was it for, for Valley Village. I did get one, it's a not clothing item, and it's gonna be really cute for Christmas. It was 99 cents. Um, it looks, isn't this cute? It's like a Christmas ornament, it says Merry Christmas, but it's, it's like tin, and I just think it's gonna be really pretty. Um, I'm gonna put it in my kitchen on a plate stand um, at Christmas time. I just liked it because it looked really like old-fashioned, vintage, so, and for 99 cents. I'm actually 20% off, so it was like, what, 80 cents? I couldn't pass it up. All right, well, again, I apologize for the lighting. I guess I should probably try and just video during the day because at night it's hard to find any place in this house that has great lighting. But thank you for watching, and I need to, um, I might actually try to do my Bath and Body Works haul, too, since I've got the house to myself right now. So... Uh, stay tuned for that, and I will just see you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching.